Hi again. I'm Ilkay Altentosh. Just like Leo, I'd like to tell you a little bit about my work here at the San Diego Civil Computer Center and UC San Diego. You might even think, what does a supercomputer center have to do with data science? Let me tell you. As you might have heard, there are many different exciting applications that are being enabled by data science in the big data era. I'm the chief data science officer at SDSC, leading our collaborative data science hub activities. At the same time, I lead our research, development, and education division, where I oversee many exciting research programs. And a role that I'm passionate about is my research center for data science workflows, which I built over time as an area since the year 2001, which is when I joined SDSC at UC San Diego. In terms of some of my education activities, I'm the faculty co-director for the Master of Advanced Studies program on data science and engineering here at UC San Diego, in which I teach a capstone project course. I also work as a lecturer for the Computer Science and Engineering Department and have done big data courses as part of other online and offline course programs. What is common to all these roles is that I work on interdisciplinary research. As a part of my core research, development, and teaching activities, I work on building methodologies and tools to make big data, data science, and computational science useful to dynamic, data-driven scientific applications. I work with many UC San Diego centers in these areas. My colleagues and I work on many grand challenge data science applications in all areas of science and engineering, including genomics, geoinformatics, metro data science or smart cities, energy management, biomedicine, personalized health, and many others uh, as a part of our data science hub. What is common? to all these applications is their unique way of bringing together new modes of data and computing research. So it's all about collaboration and what the supercomputer center brings to it as the computing and data management expertise. So what do I do on a regular day is to think about how I can get a group of very smart people collaborate to solve data science challenges. I worry about questions like, how do we close the loop on data science methods, tools, computing and data systems, and domain experts? These questions also get translated to research challenges and toolboxes for data science by my research group. Our main goal is methodology and tool development to build automated and operational workflow-driven solution architectures on big data and high-performance computing platforms. This applies to many scientific disciplines. Let me tell you a project we work on as a part of many of these applications. It is for wildfire analytics, which breaks up into two components, prediction and emergency response. Wildfire is a collaborative project funded by the National Science Foundation to build a cyber infrastructure for wildfire monitoring, prediction, and resilience. It's a research project which led to very useful insights. In Wi-Fi, we built a scalable cyber infrastructure that can utilize any high-end computing, cloud, and big data platform for dynamic big data-driven fire modeling and prediction. The approach here is to use real-time data to learn about the dynamics of fire behavior and environment, and using data science techniques, assimilate what we learn into a fire model to adapt to changes in the situation over time. Here, data science methods and workflows were used for system integration and dynamic application scalability. All the data, models, and computing systems being used were there before Wi-Fi, but a programmable system integration that can match the application needs were lacking. Data science enabled such computing capabilities to become available to fire response, research, and planning com uh, communities. In fact, the system is being used as, as a situational awareness tool by some fire departments already, and we are really happy about that. 
But Wi-Fi represents a wide range of applications where real-time big data can be assimilated with modeling and simulation tools for better situational awareness and dynamic decision support. Just take a moment to imagine how data science will help with firefighting in the future. Many streams of data will come together in 3D displays that can show all the related information along with weather and fire predictions. That would be a great application of data science uh, with societal impact. Needless to say, none of these would be possible without the collaboration of many individuals showing how important interdisciplinary collaboration is to data science. Hope you enjoyed hearing about what I do, and I'm looking forward to sharing some of exciting data science use cases with you over the next 10 weeks.